Man, the apocalypse can be rough. That's why here's a nice little meditative practice to help rebirth and renew you that I picked up from a group of people called the Druzies while living in the Middle East. And not the Druids, different, Druzy. And I've seen a similar meditation practice done in a lot of cultures. Some people call it like a snake rebirth, some the shattering pot. But I'm going to explain to you the basic form, but you can do it a lot more simply than this. You don't need to do it the traditional way, which I was told was at sunset. As the sun is setting, you face the sun and you spread out your arms and just take a few deep breaths. Now you don't have to spread out your arms, but the reason is you're just trying to open yourself up, feeling a little bit vulnerable, which is kind of the purpose. So make sure that you, you know, don't have any raiders nearby. Now, as you're doing this, picture yourself as nothing. Really just empty everything inside you with every breath. And then picture the blackness of your entire body right at the center, right in the navel. There's a small little light bouncing off that sun. And as the sun fades, it grows and it starts to burn out everything bad, everything negative. Maybe you looted a whole family that didn't need to be looted. Maybe you pillaged a whole village that didn't need to be pillaged. Whatever it is, if it's bad, know it's bad, don't repeat it. If it's good, repeat it. And then have that light spread out throughout the blackness of your body, out to your skin, and have everything that you don't want harden on the tops and on the edges of your fingertips and on your skin. Now this is the part where some people say snake, some people say it's like clay baking. You're wet as you're building it and then once you fully dry or harden all of the awfulness, you shake it off real quick and that doesn't even have to be physical, but you're supposed to shed it a little bit. So real simply, you're basically just opening yourself up to the world, imagining nothing inside your body, then a light that expands pushing out everything you don't want, crystallizing on your skin, and then breaking it off. And then you're set for at least another couple days of plunder. And have a good apocalypse.